Just for the start of today's video, the first comment is going to win themselves a mystery box. So congrats for one that's the main prize. I'm actually giving away a $50 payment scroll. So be answered, just leave a like on today's video. Be subscribed to my channel with notifications on and comment your in-game name on Ico. And that's pretty much all you have to do. So good luck on this giveaway and I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. All right, it's finally bonus XP. So let's use all our tickets. Damn, just 90 tickets got me to 80 jealousy. So this won't take me long at all to get to 99. Not too bad. Alright, we just did quite a bit of dungeoneering. There's like a dungeoneering bonus on giving like 10% more XP and tokens or something. We ended up being 107 dungeoneering, so yeah, 2.4 mil. We're gonna have plenty, dude. But yeah, that should definitely be enough for everything we need from dungeoneering, pretty much. Nice. Alright, so we just did a because of Gothic today. 57 prayer. Okay, not bad. Alright, we just finished making pretty much all the potions we had. I do still have some uh, qualms, but I don't really need to make those right now. We ended up with 400 restores, 72 prayer pots. That should last us for quite a while in terms of prayer. The stats are honestly looking pretty good. 1900 total on the Elite already, and some of our stats are still like really, really low, so... Not bad. Dude, I just got Dragon Boots and a D-Chain from Dust Devils. Let's go! Right, from one town board, I literally got four D chains and two are drained me somehow. And we also got 94 magic, so now we can cast Ice Barrage, which is pretty cool. Not bad. Very right, nice, there it is. We got 80 crafting, so I had a bit more uh, gems in the bank. I thought I might as well get this so I can actually make a glory. Alright, Dragonstone Emmy. Gimme, gimme. Alright, let's make our glory. Boom, Enchanted Dragonstone Emmy. That's an achievement too. Amulet Glory unlocked. Alright, this should be Restless Ghost done. Gimme my prayer XP. 61 prayer, not bad. Alright, there's Horror from the Deep done, and defeat the Danganoff Mother. I think we can buy all the books now. Nice. Alright, nice. There is 80 attack. Now we can actually wear Chaotix. This should make training a lot faster than using a D-Skin. Alright, we just used our own sword heads, and that goes to 64 prayer. I still need, like, another 6 levels, and I'm not really too sure how to get them, so I think I'm just gonna use the rest of my Penguin Lamps. Alright, nice. So, we had, like, 55 lamps, so we only used, like, 20 to get to 70. Obviously, we're only getting, like, around 70k XP, which isn't much, but it gets us to level 70. We'll take it. Alright, there it is. Focus Sight. So, I got a Desert Strike Worm task, and I thought I might as well do it since I need this for the full Slayer Helm, so there it is. Focus Sight. Nice. 83 Slayer. Alright, we can actually kill Krakens now. Alright, we just completed 13 Slayer tasks, and we should now be able to afford a Slayer Helm, I believe. This should be kind of a good upgrade. Nice. Alright, there are Barrage Gloves done. That was honestly pretty easy. Nice. Alright, there are Barrage Gloves unlocked. Nice. Alright, there's the Hex Crest. Now I can actually make this into a full Slayer Helmet, which is basically like a Slayer Helmet imbued on Earth's Rest. So currently, it only works for melee, but if I put a Hex Crest and Focus Light on this, it'll be a full Slayer Helmet and work for Magic and Range as well. So, alright, let's make the Slayer Helmet. I think this is all we need. Make a full Slayer Helmet. Boom. Nice. Dude, I literally got a whip in like my first stack of Abyssal Demons, dude. I've killed- I got two whips! I've gotten two whips in 11kc. Damn, Elite Iron Man drop rates are kind of good, dude. Oh nice, we just got a champion scroll from a Fire Giant task, we'll take that. That should be some nice Lyrics, dude. Alright, nice, we just got 99 strength. That's our first 99 on this account, apart from Dungeon Air, I guess. Well, our first combat 99, we'll take it. Alright, nice, we got Necro's task, and I just hit 99 Mage and 94 Slayer. The stats are coming along very, very nicely. Alright, nice, we just got 99 hit points. So, if you're wondering where I'm at, this is the E Zone dungeon, by the way. That's like a private Rock Lobster spot. I don't think many people know about this, so this is actually pretty damn nice for getting charms and stuff. Thought I might as well like start getting some charms. Anyways, we're also getting a shit ton of pure essence here, so this should actually be really good for ring crafting too, which is kind of nice. So the plan is, get as many charms as we need for 99 summoning, and then we'll be able to use a pancake, which will be very useful for training our ring crafting. Apart from that, almost 2100 total. The stats are looking very, very nice. Alright, this should be the last rock lobster we kill for now. So we end up getting like 95 defense just from barraging. We have a shit ton of magic XP, 50 mil magic XP. <laughs> We ended up with exactly 50,000 pure essence, that's honestly pretty cool, and a lot of charms, so and we have a lot more in the bank just from doing Slayer. This should definitely be uh, enough to get 99, like more than enough. God damn, we have plenty. Alright, so in terms of summoning, I think the plan is we're going to use only blue charms. These give like by far the most XP, and we're going to make spirit jellies all the way up until 89. Let's get started. Alright, I think this should be the last one, so we pretty much only did Spirit Jelly Pouches, like you can see, and we got all the way until 89 from that. We used around 400, 500 charms, I think, so not too bad. Let's catch all these scrolls for Spirit Shards, thank you very much. And now we can finally move on to the Giza Titans. Alright, there we go, finally. Water Talismans, how'd you XP? 300k XP for one inventory, dude. Holy shit, that is OP. Alright, these should be the last 10 pouches we make. Alright, let's get it. 
There is 99 summoning. Let's go. All right. Another 99 in the account. So we only used a thousand blue charms. So we went like really, really overkill with um, 99 summoning. That's pretty nice. All right, another Tiz Gothic. It actually goes 180k XP, all the way to 59 construction. I haven't even touched this skill yet. That's honestly not bad. All right, so I've gotten some Frost Dragon Bones and Dragon Bones just from doing like some Slayer and stuff. So I'm just going to use them on the Gilded Altar at Uberzone real quick. And hopefully this will give me a good amount of prayer XP. Oh man, we are so close to getting some Prayer. I also bought some Prayer Brawling Gloves because these actually increase your XP. But I already used like one Envy of Frost Dragon Bones before I even realized that. But 10k XP away. Do I have any sort of bones to think? Oh wait, we have another 22 Frost. Alright, nice, we're chilling. Alright, there it is, 77. We can now use Rogan Augury, I just need to unlock them now. Not bad. Alright, there's all the insult heads done. So that goes all the way to almost 83 prayers. So I think for the rest, I'm just going to use some lamps and see how much speed that gets us. Alright, we used all of our lamps and that got us to 87 prayers. So we're still quite a bit way off 95, which we need for thermal, but... That's a decent chunk of the bitway there. Alright, let's finally unlock these prayers. There's Rigor and there is Augury, so now we should be able to use them. I think if I relog it should show. Oh yeah, there it is. Nice. Rigor and Augury unlocked. Not bad. Alright, level 40. That means we get a drop rate boost, so how much drop rate does it give us now? That's 2% drop rate and we've already got 1% before, so we now have like an extra 3% drop rate. And obviously 12% comes with our mode, so we basically have 15% drop right now. That's kind of OP. Alright, there should be 70 runecraft and there it is. So this means you can now do a Zorcano. And believe it or not, water runes I think are generally the best XP low level until like soul runes maybe. But yeah, almost base 70 stats apart from construction. The stats are looking very, very nice. We just said 2200 total too. Not bad. Alright, we have 5 hard clues and 2 elite caskets. Can we get anything good? Let's start with the hard clues. Some rock tails? Okay, okay. Nothing really too good. 20 Amulet of Glories? Debu Ordman Kit? Zamrock Chaps? Yo. Why don't I trade my crafting, dude? I could just open this. 98 steel play bodies? Yo, that's like 500 steel bars right there. Dude, clues are kind of OP. God damn, bro. We just got full god dehyde. Clues are very OP. Alright, time for the elites. A bucket helm, dragon sweat, orange shield, dragon. How many? Dude, 25 dragon battle axes. Jesus, dude. Alright, next one. Slayer task skill scroll. Oh, black dehyde. Yo, actually, that's kind of huge because if I get like a a town ball task, then that's kind of nice. Could open 188 Slayer caskets. So these actually have the chance to give you an imbued heart. Let me just see what the rate is. Holy, okay, that is rare. One in 4,250, dude. God damn, that is rare. Let's see what we get. Alright, 13 caskets left. We definitely got like a lot of cash. I think I made like a good 50 mil from opening all those. Alright, there's 80 Hunter. Now we can use five box traps. So I think the plan right now is we're just gonna catch as many rage and then just use them for range because I think that's probably the best range for you right now. We basically run out of cannonballs even while doing the slam and we're pretty much done with melee stats anyway. We're like 199 like strength like we have like almost 60 mil magic XP so we don't really need more slayer at the moment but we do need to get that range up a little bit, so hopefully these chins will help out. Alright, we caught around 516 red chins. Hopefully this will give us some decent range XP. Yo, we got 99 Slayer, dude. I didn't even realize. Let's go. Alright, hopefully 99 range soon as well. Alright, just use the last of our chins and that got us to 97 range. I think we'll just stop there for now. I think I'll just get the rest levels myself, just by doing Gaunt or something, but stats are not too bad. Alright guys, we just did our first Gauntlet. No blue chest. Sad. Alright, alright. Now the real challenge begins. Corrupted Gauntlet. 